Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we're gonna be talking about the CRTO exam from Zero Point Security. So if you guys are new to the channel, please like, subscribe, and share. Let's have some fun and jump into it. All right, folks, so here we go. So as always, when I get a new certification or if I do a new training, or if something that's a worthwhile to share, I love sharing my experience, giving a review when good things are good, when bad things are bad, whatever. I always just give my honest review and I think that's what a lot of people appreciate. So the first thing I wanna say from the bottom of my heart to Zero Point Security, thank you so much for an awesome, awesome experience. Daniel, Rasta Mouse, you're awesome. Keep up the good work. I just wanna say that from me to you, brother. So Red Team Ops exam, what is this all about? Before we actually get into the meat and potatoes of that, what I wanna say as well is red teaming is not penetration testing and penetration testing is not red teaming. Just putting that out there, they're two different things. Now I really understand the difference. Before I used to think I knew, but I was like, oh, maybe it's similar, it has some, but you know, yeah, you have to understand some Cobra saying you get a ticket, blah, 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 but it's, you know, I didn't use Kali Linux in this exam. You know, it's nothing like that. So yeah, it's, it, it, it's a little different to say the least. Anyhow, so I wanna get into all the questions because I have gotten asked how long did it take me? How long was the exam? How was the exam? Hopefully I answer all your questions. And if I don't answer your question, please leave it in the comments below and I will be sure to answer as, be as best as I can and whatever I can convey. Right? I'm not gonna give you answers to the exam. I'm not gonna do any of that. But I wanna give you my journey from last Thursday to Sunday when I took the exam, because that's pretty much what happened. So let's take a deep breath and the exam information. So obviously, you know, you guys can read this as well. So the Red Team Ops exam is a practical CTF style driven event driven by Snap Labs. So that's pretty much like a cyber range. You have some machines and guacamole and you know, you have your different machines and you go to town. So, <coughs> excuse me, almost dying. So it's an assumed breach scenario by the student to emulate an adversary using the provided threat profile as a guide. So say for example, we have a guide that says, okay, this is your scenario of what's going on blah, blah, blah. I'm not gonna tell you, I'm not gonna show you, so sorry about that. I don't wanna get beat up by Daniel. So this profile is available by Snap Labs event as soon as the booking is made. So once you book your exam, you can log in, you can see all that and all that good stuff. So yeah, so let's keep going down and you will get a temporary password email to you for Snap Labs once you uh, sign up and then you just create your password and go on from there. So how is it graded? So each machine each machine has flags, you know, it's just like a CTF type thing. And you submit your flag to show proof of your progress. And you have like your flag right here, you submit it, and then you get 10 points. Students must submit at least six flags in order to get 75% to pass. That's exactly what I did. I did six flags and I was done. I was good for the day, right? I didn't need to keep continuing. For me, it just didn't make sense. I already passed and why waste more time and get all eight flags? That was just me, sorry. But, um, cause I did it on a Sunday. I did it in the afternoon, in the middle of the day and all that good stuff. So if you come down, this is pretty much how it looks. You have your leaderboard, you have your fancy name, you have your score like Rasta right here, this is his, his he got a 70, I, he beat me by 10 points, good job. Just kidding. So students have a maximum of, so you have pretty much 48 hours of runtime. So the lab runs for 48 hours and you have to use this within a four day window. It's not like 48 hours, I can pause it for two hours today and two hours next week. You have a four day window to do that. And the VMs can be stopped at any time to preserve runtime. So say for an example, got a itchy nose, and say for an example, you have to go eat dinner or go to the store or go to the gym 
or whatever you need to do, you know, you, you pause it, you come back, you resume, you're good to go. I didn't do that. I just went straight through and we'll get into all that uh, a little bit later. So as it shows here, if enough flags have been collected by the end of the four days, you will be granted with the pretty, pretty uh, congratulations. When I, when I got mine, I was, I was really stoked. I think this was a, one of my, I don't know, most accomplished, but like I, it feel really good to get this certification. And, uh, and I know I collect them like Pokemon cards, but this one really, I'm gonna go get it printed out. I'm actually gonna put it right, right on my, uh, my shelf here. And then I have another spot down there for my cape whenever I take the hack the box cape exam. But uh, anyhow, this is about the red team one, and I'm gonna take a pretty picture next to my red team security uh, flag over there and uh, be like the cool kids on the block and rock my red team. You see red team right here. You probably can't see it because the mic, but uh, rocking, I'm all, I'm all wannabe red teamered out. Anyhow, you can reschedule your exam if you want, and there is no VPN. So right here you have it says it right here, access to the environment is only provided by Guacamole Interface. So this is where I'll say the only caveat or the only bad or the only complaint that I have is it was pretty slow. That's it. Like if you, sometimes I thought it would be locked up. I had to restart one of my machines one time. So it just like, that was probably the only bad thing. It was just a little slow. But, you know, if that's the only thing, I'll deal with it. So you can go ahead and book it now. Give it a shot, you know. And if Daniel, if you ever see this man, like I would be honored to partner up and and, and do some stuff together, and uh, maybe I'll do the the, the the lead one next. But uh, for those to have a free attempt via, you know, if you have the course, I didn't take the course, so I don't, you know, if I failed, I would have been out of a uh, hundred and twenty-five dollars or something like that because it's ninety-nine pounds. I think it was like 125 bucks or something. So, oh, one other thing um, that I want to bring up. If you do this, make sure you sign up first with Zero Point before you purchase. Because just at least in the States, this is what happened to me. I was getting errors and then it would, like it charged my account and then I had to email them and I got the money back. Once I signed up with Zero Point, created an account, all that stuff, and then I purchased my voucher, boom, it was golden. So that's a little bug that I found. And um, yeah, so so if you get an error, that's the reason why, at least that was my reason. Once I signed up, I had my account, then I went back in here, and then I picked my day, which was the second, and then I scheduled it and I passed, thank God. All right, so that's that for the course or for the, um, I think that's for the courses. But if we go to red team courses, I think that goes to the same one. Yeah, and then it goes to here. No, apps, no, sorry, I'm lying. So the course is the whole shebang. I didn't buy the course, I just bought the exam for 99 pounds. So, you know, I just, I just winged it. So yeah, so if you buy the course, you're more than, you know, more than happy to do so. You can buy now. Let's go ahead and buy it now. And oh, I don't want to buy it now. I just want to see, I thought you can see what's in it. Let's uh, come back. Uh, did it, did. Let's go back to courses and let's go to red team. And let's see if I can figure this out. I'm a red teamer. Let's try to figure out this. So let me, oh, down. If you just come down, you can see the, the course curriculum, getting started and all this good stuff. So every single thing, in here is good to know. Obviously, you know, there's a lot of stuff in here. Co Cobalt Strike, which I thought was really cool about this exam. When you, you have to set up your Cobalt Strike, you have to set it up, you have to make sure your team server's running. So pretty much what you learn probably in the course, which I didn't do the course, you probably learn how to set it up, you learn how to do all that configuration, all that good stuff. So definitely pay attention to that because you're gonna need to do that in the exam. All right, so if you do bundles, you can go ahead and buy everything for 800 pounds, which is probably $900. And the exams, like I just went over right now, you can just go buy the exam. And then this is the RT uh, team lead. So this is the next one. Maybe one day I'll have the balls to give this a jingle. I might have to go through the course because I'm not 
you know, I'm a wannabe. So if we go to my dashboard, what is my dashboard? This is, I think this is when I was, uh, I didn't purchase it. So I guess like when I was just looking, seeing what it was all about, or I don't think I have it. Um, maybe I do. I don't think so. But anyhow, let's go back to the dashboard. And then that's pretty much it, you know? And then let's go ahead and go to, what is this? Merch. So I wanted to, you know, probably buy something. I'm not going to buy it because I'm not going to put my credit card out there. But I definitely want to rock one of these shirts. So uh, if you guys obviously show love to Daniel and Rasta Mouse, uh, go ahead and just show them some love. You know, I, I really appreciate, you know, this exam. It's it, it. It was a good one. It was fun. I learned a few things and uh, hopefully the CRTL will be down the line. But that's it for my review. My honest opinion, I loved it. I hope you guys love this video. If you want to jump on the bandwagon and be a wannabe red teamer like me, go for this exam. You'll learn a lot. You'll definitely be grateful for doing it. It's an awesome certification to get. And you'll be proud that you're a CRTO as well. So thank you so much for viewing and I'll see all you guys in the next one.